In today's video, we have our first official images of the 2023 May 4th UCS X-Wing. Let's look at them, guys. So guys, welcome back to another LEGO Star Wars video. This is going to be a very quick one going over our first official images of the UCS X-Wing coming out um, only in one month from now. So we basically have known for a while this was going to get revealed at Star Wars Celebration this weekend, but it actually looks like it got you know revealed even earlier um i actually broke the the news or the first image of it uh a little bit earlier today if you guys saw that on my second instagram account but um now we have official images of you know the box art and a couple out of the box ones and uh, the minifigures and yeah so we have set numbers uh 75355 five, 1949 pieces 18 plus of course and is the uh the x-wing you know the ucs x-wing right here so basically to get into my quick thoughts you know we're going to keep this video short is i don't like it you know look again it's just the truth of it um and even read all these comments you know a lot of people are saying even earlier and especially now with these images uh there's a lot of things that are just fundamentally wrong with this set and for 240 dollars, and for being 10 years you know after this one you know look all i can say now is after seeing this dude I'm, I'm a lot happier that I actually have this still. Like, you know, for a while there, I was thinking, damn, like, okay, this one's going to go down in value. Uh, you know, the new one's going to blow this one out of the water. But um, believe me, after seeing these images now, um, you know, I'm just, I'm happier I have the 2013 one now even. So, uh, first off, I want to say, I think on the new set, the box art is atrocious. I think it's very awkward, a terrible angle for them. I don't know why they chose that. But, uh, yeah, overall, look, guys, I mean, the Luke Skywalker minifigure, he's cool. He's decent. Whatever. You know what I mean? Like, we'll get him, you know, 240 bucks. You get an exclusive figure. Uh, sure. But um, R2-D2 also looks pretty awkward because it's literally just the minifigure uh, head sticking out of the top of a massive ship. I mean, it's super disproportional. Um, some people are saying the X-Foils are way too far apart. In my opinion, it kind of looks like the X-Wing literally, like, ran into a brick wall. And it kind of looks like it's, like, super, like, stubby almost. And as I, basically everyone's saying, I mean, the proportions are just wrong, like overall, and it's just kind of awkward. And for being 10 years later, you would think, you know, look, all these new parts, all these new techniques they came up with. And I got to be honest with you, dude. I mean, I'm not even the biggest X-Wing fan. I'm not, but you know, all day of the week, I mean, sure. A little bit of nostalgia possibly, you know, but I get, I don't even really like the sets. I'm not even an X-Wing fan, but I would still, I mean, just fundamentally, I'm looking at both right here. I got my 2013 one. And it's the exact same angle as well and i'm just being honest with you like look maybe on the 2013 one maybe you tile off this front little nose a little bit more maybe you throw a couple tiles on here like the new one if you put those tan and white tiles on the 2013 nose i think the 2013 one just blows it out of the water but uh there's that guys that's pretty much what we know about the ucs x-wing for now i'm um, coming out you know may 1st i believe you know that is supposedly when they're starting their may 4th promos this year uh, may 1st you know through may 4th or may 5th or whatever and the one last thing I'll, I'll say about star wars celebration this weekend is apparently uh from what i know right now this could change in the next couple days if something stays you know hidden um there's gonna be no star wars celebration exclusive all they're gonna do is just like how they did with the kenobi brickhead last year they're gonna take that endor five pack you know throw a little you know paper around it and say hey look i bought this first at star wars celebration like i'll show a picture of it like very lame very lackluster you know you can get the brickhead you know what three weeks in advance but um it would be cooler man if it was like a specialty box art but it's literally just a piece of paper that you just slip on and off so that's the rumor for now guys no star wars you know celebration exclusive but uh you know get your brick cat early you know oh no dude oh, oh you know be a badass you know get your brick cat three weeks early um you know with nothing exclusive on it so that definitely sucks you know look i go back to doing exclusives lego everyone loves them so uh that's everything for today guys a quick video leave your thoughts down below what do you guys think 2013 2023 are you guys buying this day one i know i'm not definitely not now heck no dude i'd rather get luke's land speeder before this and i probably will i honestly will i think luke's land speeder is you know a great ucs set uh, you know, this X-Wing, I think, is the first bad UCS set they've done in, you know, 10 years or whatever. So that's everything, guys. Leave your thoughts down below. See you guys all in the next one. Bye, guys, and stay safe.